Do you own Bitcoin? No? Then I encourage you to participate in this revolutionary technology. Yes? Perfect. Let's move on. Why do you own Bitcoin? Because of the girls. Because I can send value to any country, to anyone, for almost no cost. Because it's freedom of speech. It's decentralized. It's everything I could ever want to be. It makes it so much easier to buy my human pituitary glands. So I can use fancy terms like elliptical curve cryptography, SHA-256, and trick all my non-Bitcoin friends into thinking I'm clever. Because uh, I want to be a rich motherfucker and, and uh, have nice clothes and a Porsche and bang hot bitches. They're interested in me because of my money. Because it lets me buy drugs through the post, except I can't buy drugs through the post anymore, at least not certain drugs, because the government checks all of my posts and all of my friends' posts as well. So its usefulness to, to, to me has now declined a bit. I've got some Bitcoin, but I'm in no way a speculator because I don't not really like speculators. It should be used to buy drugs through the post to, so drugs get legal quicker because everyone will be doing it anyway. Yeah, and also to launder money but not to fund ISIS. I don't support ISIS in any way. It doesn't matter why you own Bitcoin. We're only going to answer one question the same. Do you want your Bitcoin stolen? No. Then why on earth would you keep your Bitcoin with a third party? If you keep most of your Bitcoin in an online wallet, on an exchange, or with a service like... then they have your private keys. And whoever has your private keys has your Bitcoin. Now, I don't want to come off as extreme and completely dismiss the value of convenience that third parties and hot wallets have to offer. I'm sure they're not all planning to steal your Bitcoin and they'll become reputable over time, but they cannot guarantee the safety of your funds. So keep a fluid amount of Bitcoin with them if you want to, but do not keep your savings with them. I know they all claim they'll keep your funds safe, but so do the banks. I'm going to make this as clear as I can. You cannot trust a third party with your money because history. Part of the beauty of Bitcoin is that it allows you to be your own bank. Why would you not take advantage of this? Bitcoin is supposed to be a step towards financial freedom, not a new convenient banking system. That's the word, isn't it? Convenience. We don't keep our own private keys because of convenience. Let me point something out. Bitcoin is very convenient to use, but it's also convenient to steal. When you opt out of keeping your own private keys, you opt into the hands of a third party. You willingly submit yourself to a company with a fancy website. Most people would rather be victims than responsible. This needs to change. Let's not squander this opportunity to be financially empowered. Let's be responsible for ourselves. Oi. Hey, you go on the balcony, you can dance on the ground floor, help yourself in the board. We're gonna shop with some pets.